six, seven, no, that ain't it. Mm, eight. And that one make five, six, five, six, seven, eight. There we go. Eight and eight. Wasn't too hard. Knowing that I'm horrible at math. So let's go down to the third level. Which I will call it. Or the, yeah, third level. And see what else we need to do to get this elevator running. Elementary, my dear Watson. Oh, another piece of paper. 17th of July, 1839. How has this escaped me? They're all dead. Limbs scattered, heads split down the middle, their skin flayed as if boiled. I feel like I'm falling into myself. What's happening? Sir William Smith, Professor Taylor, now Dr. Tate. Is it following me? How can it not be? It's the damn thing I brought from Africa. Something is after me. I have no choice but to trust the Baron. He better know what he claims. If he is wrong, I suspect he'll regret it as well. Yes, they're all after you, Daniel. They want to kill you. They want to eat you alive. Dun dun dun! Alright, let's see. Let's crank this sucker up. Well. Nothing in the burner for it to ignite. Okay. Cool. So I'm guessing I pick up some coal, along with the tinderbox. Okay, clump of coal. Let's go throw it in there. Yeah, I want to guess three, just three, because like any other good Zelda game, you need three of everything. Yeah. Give me that coal. You've been a naughty boy. Santa not give you no prizes. See if I can make it here. Eh. Aw. Well, I'm no basketball star. Eh. Yep, three. Alright. I guess it started up. Guess I gotta start this then. Machinery needs more work for it to run. There are missing cogwheels to be fitted. Okay. I guess I gotta find cogwheels. I guess this is one over here. Man, these suckers must be heavy as hell. Alright. Got one. I'm guessing there's two more upstairs. I didn't see any other ones down here while I was getting the coal. So let's go upstairs and find that other coal wheel so we can get this damn elevator running. Oh, there's one. Who would just take the cog wheels out and just throw them in random places? I mean, that doesn't make sense. You think you would, like, I don't know, just take them out and throw them on the floor if you didn't want them to work. But, you know, you want to be that ass that just... It doesn't fit. There we go. That ass that throws them in random places, so the person that wants to fix it has to go look. Let's just run up these stairs. Uh, is there another cogwheel in here? I don't see a cogwheel. No. Should the other one be all the way up here? It probably is. It, it probably is. Hmm. Where are you, Mr. Cogwheel? Cogwheel! Cogwheel! 
We need cogwheel. I bet you it's very hot in here from all that steam. Alright, cogwheel, where you at? Where you at, Bo? I'm out over there. Um, I bet you it's in that other that I didn't really look through. So let me see. Let me see here. Yep, there it is. Right there on the table. Mommy told me to not run with scissors, but she did not tell me not to cogwheel. Ho ho ho. Ah. Alright, bad jokes aside. Let's get this elevator running. And go. Alright, so that should have made the elevator work. If I'm not mistaken. Watch a zombie pop out in front of me. That would be just hilarious. Nope. More slime. The slime wants my brain. It wants to eat me alive. Alive! Oh, damn it. And again. Sick of health pot. He panted heavily, trying his best to keep himself from screaming. The medicine cabinet had been overturned and lay collapsed on the floor. He reached through the broken glass and grabbed all the sedatives he could find. Slime. And we can't go back to the cool fountain. That sucks. Man, I wanted to see the cool fountain again. Anyway, all things aside, I'm going to end it off here. So in the next part, next recording, I mean, we are going to find out what horrors lay on the other side of that elevator. See you then.